and welcome back to Lance on Truck, where today I'll be teaching you basic redirects. So there are two main different types of redirects. The first involves using the chain part of the nunchuck in order to wrap around points of your body, such as your waist, in order to lose the momentum that is gained by swinging the nunchuck so that you can reflect it off of that point and away from that side. The second type of redirect involves smacking this part of the nunchuck back so this front part right here, because if you smack the end, it'll hurt a lot more. But if you smack this front part right here, it's a quick way to change the direction that your nunchuck is spinning. So like this. A few points of your body that you can easily wrap the chain around of the nunchuck in order to change the direction that they're spinning is your waist, your shoulders, or your hands if you're grabbing the chain. The most important redirects where the chain wraps around a point of your body are waist redirects, so you bring it over to one side to your waist while the other side is swinging, and touch it to your waist and let the other side orbit around, and then with that momentum you swing it back and bring it to the other waist, and you touch the top of the nunchuck to your waist right here, bring it to this side, and with that momentum swing it back outwards. Another really important one is the shoulder one. You bring it and you pretty much touch it, touch the top of the nunchuck to your forearm or your shoulder, and then the nunchuck on the other side will swing freely down here, but then using the momentum with the swing that goes backwards, you can swing it free again. There are a lot more areas where you can redirect using the technique of smacking the nunchuck because it doesn't wrap around those points. For instance, you can use your forearms, shoulders, or even feet, hands, backs of hands, forearms, elbows, and other things like that. Some of the most basic redirects that involve smacking the nunchuck include redirecting it off of your hand. So for instance, if you have an open palm on this side, you can bounce it off of that, swing it around, and bounce it off the bottom again. So when you go like this, you can bounce it off the bottom, swing it back, and bounce it off the top again. It is also a good idea to combine these two. For instance, when you swing over your shoulder, this end may swing upwards and hit you in the face if you don't have your other hand here to reflect it the other way, so by smacking it. So when you bring it up, you can have the chain orbit around your forearm, but you can have your other hand here in order to stop it or redirect it so that it doesn't come up and hit you anywhere else. Knowing your redirects is extremely important because later on, you can use this in order to align your nunchucks perfectly so that you can do bigger moves like throws and wrist rolls. So I hope you learned something today. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more tutorials coming in the future, and go check out some of the other tutorials that I have on my channel.